As a YouTuber, whether you like it or not, video editing is really important when it comes to the success of your channel. That's the reason I recently invested into a full-time video editor. But that's not how I started. In fact, I started with a very simple to use video editing system, which is exactly what I'll be walking you through in today's video. I'm gonna give you the best video editors for YouTubers from a beginner level where you're just getting started with making content all the way to a professional level where you can do animations, high level cuts, and anything you can imagine. All right, so starting off with a simple to use editor, that will be CapCut. CapCut is very simple to use. It's beginner friendly, as well as available on all devices, Windows, Mac, as well as smartphones, which makes it really accessible for anyone to get started with. Even though CapCut is a beginner friendly editing system, it has all the features that you probably need. So it has all the advanced features, it's just that they made it really easy to use them. CapCut actually competes with more professional editing tools like DaVinci Resolve, for example. However, they are easier and faster to use. You can very easily trim videos, you can cut videos, you can add them together, you can add effects, you can add transitions. All things like that are covered, which is great if you're just getting started making videos because the goal should be to start uploading as soon as possible. That way, you learn faster because you're making more videos and the more videos you'll make, the better you'll become. When I started making YouTube videos back in 2019, that's exactly what I did myself. All the animations that you might see in this video, that's not how I got started. There's a full-time video editor behind that that knows exactly how to do that. I myself, I have no idea. So my videos existed out of a face cam and screen recording footage. So all I needed to do was load in those clips into my video editing system, cut out all of the mistakes and then put them together. And that's exactly where the next editing tool comes in handy. This one is called Gling AI. Now, no matter which of the actual video editing tools you'll end up using, I believe that Gling AI is a tool that every YouTuber should use. See, the biggest problem with video editing is that it's time consuming. Gling AI is an automatic editing tool that allows you to cut out all of your mistakes in your recordings with AI technology, and that will save you hours and hours of your time. So the first step is submitting the video that you recorded. Once you've done that, the Gling AI timeline will open. Now from here, what you will see is that they've already automatically cut out all the mistakes that you made in your recording. In the bottom right corner, you can actually see how many cuts it made, which often will add up into the hundreds, which shows you how much time a tool like this can save you. From here on, you can customize anything you want. So you can simply start playing the video. And when you notice that maybe they've cut out something that you like to keep in, all you need to do is look at the left side of your screen and you actually see the captions. So they'll automatically create captions for what you're saying in your video. If you want to put it back, you simply click on the scissor icon once again, and it will then be put back into your video. And the same goes for the reverse. So if there's still something in your video that you'd like to cut out, you can simply click on the scissor icon and it will then be cut out from the video. That's an insanely useful tool that saves you a lot of time, especially if you make long form content. Now, as soon as you're done, you've now cut out all of the mistakes. From here on, you can render your new file, which is basically your video without any mistakes, as either an MP4 video, so that your video is just fully done. But what I also like, and it's actually perfect, you can edit this as a file that goes into a different video editor. So we use this tool to cut out all the mistakes from a raw recording like this. We then render it as a Premiere Pro file and then we continue editing in that tool. So I like to look at this more as a pre-editor that any YouTuber should use to just save yourself a bunch of time. If you wanna find out more about this, I'll leave a link for you in the description down below so that you can try it out. Now with that said, let's move up the ranks a bit. A very solid video editor for someone that would like to improve their skills from beginner level to an intermediate level is DaVinci Resolve. So we've got DaVinci Resolve open right here. Now DaVinci is known for its stability, especially on newer computers. Now you might wonder, why is that a good thing? Well, a lot of other softwares can crash quite a lot. DaVinci Resolve doesn't crash very often, which is great because then it doesn't slow up the editing process, which for example, on something like Premiere Pro, happens quite a lot. I often get a message from my video editor that the video is gonna be a little bit late because he has some issues with the software. So with DaVinci, that barely happens, which is a great thing. On top of that, DaVinci is an all-in-one solution. Now, what I mean by that is that all the tools 
that you might need to get a video done are within one program. So you can do motion graphics on DaVinci Resolve, as well as text animations, color grading, cutting the video, everything that you want to do on DaVinci Resolve. Plus, it is quite easy to use. Now, DaVinci has a free program, so you can just get started for this for free. And as soon as you like to increase the level of your videos, you can upgrade to the paid studio and they will give you access to the higher level features that they use in Hollywood, for example, as well. And then let's show you the holy grail of video editing. Now, of course, video editing tools are always a personal preference and often depends on what you got started with. However, I had to put this one on the list as this is used by my own video editor, which I think you'll agree is not too bad at what he does, especially lately with all the animations in my videos. And that's where Adobe Premiere comes in. So Premiere Pro has a bunch of advanced tools that can handle pretty much anything, obviously from simple cuts, all the way to full-blown cinematic edits. And what is cool about Premiere is that it works seamlessly with all the other Adobe apps. For example, like After Effects, which is what my editor uses to do all of these video animations. However, what I do like about Premiere Pro that many other editors don't really play with yet is the AI features that it has available. For example, it has an auto reframing tool, which basically means that you can turn this video into any format for YouTube, TikTok, Instagram, whatever it is, automatically web AI, as well as a speech to text tool, for example, that can create captions in seconds. Now, especially if you look back in the day, if I were to put captions under the video that I'm recording right now, that will take so much time as the editor has to type out everything manually. Whereas right now with Premiere Pro, you can just press a few buttons and whatever I'm saying is appearing right now here on the screen. What I also like about Premiere is that it is perfect for collaboration. So if you're starting to grow your YouTube channel and one video requires multiple people to work on it, this is perfect for you. You can share projects and work together on the same timeline without getting in each other's way. On Premiere Pro, you also have a bunch of plugins that you can start using to make sure that whatever it is that you're trying to create, it is possible. However, I can also understand that all of this looks and feels a bit too intimidating for you. Because of that, I've got one final video editing tool left that still can get all of this done, but in a slightly easier way. And that is called Final Cut Pro. Final Cut Pro might be the perfect option for you because it's easy to use but it's also powerful. So Final Cut Pro is known for being super user friendly while still having all the great editing features. So if you've got a Mac device, Final Cut Pro is perfect for you as it works very, very smoothly as well as fast on any Mac device out there. And they've got everything that you might need. So you can easily cut content, you can put it together, you can add transitions, effects, you can do color grading, you can add LUTs, which are lookup tables, which pretty much influences the color of your footage. On top of that, unlike other video editors, Final Cut Pro is a one-time purchase. So it's on a subscription model. And that means that you pay once and you get all the lifetime updates. With all of that said, I am excited for you to level up your content game, go after it, and then I will see you in the next video.